Hey guys and welcome back to another episode of the Sims 4 100 Vampire Baby Challenge. So if you guys didn't watch the last episode, then you wouldn't have known that Angelique gave birth to twins. So I'm pretty happy with the fact that I added the lot trait that lets you have multiple babies. So I feel like maybe this challenge might not be as hard as I think, but again, we're only 2 out of 100, so there's still a lot more to go. And um... I did discover how to get her to turn other sims, so I did some research and turns out that I have to buy it here. So this is the thing, it's vampire creation, gain the power to turn other sims into vampires. Angelique's desire may be to increase the pool of vampiric kind, either to ensure she has eternal friends or for her eternal life, or to outspace the sim population. With vampire creation, Angelique can turn sims into vampires, allowing them to live as the undead for the first time. So, I'm going to go ahead and purchase this because that, does that mean I can't buy this? Oh, I don't have enough. Okay. I was going to say, I was like, we already have this. So I'm pretty sure that we're still able to use it, but I guess we don't have enough points, I think, is what the case is. Milestone complete. Angelique has completed. I have the power of the vampire aspiration. Oh my god, I didn't know we did that. Become a prime... Become a prime vampire, train three offspring, convert five sims into full-grown vampires. <gasps> what? Oh my god. Okay, alright. So, she can now turn sims into vampires. So that's awesome. So we can, we're gonna have to go ahead and invite Marcus Flex over. Okay, they're crying, but they're not. Oh, okay, now they are. Alright, you you're now a mommy. You need to take care of your babies. Oh my god, twins. Okay, we're gonna feed, cuddle. And make silly face. All right, which this one's Donatella and this one's Lilith. So we're probably gonna go ahead and see if we can invite um, Marcus over before it becomes too late. So all right, we're gonna have to send text to him, and then we're gonna oh okay, and then invite to hang out at current lot. Hopefully, I'll be able to turn them. I mean, turn him because that is like. <laughs> I need to get this going. How do I know how many aspiration points I have? I can't remember how to figure that out. Oh, here it is. Reward store. So we have 1,525 points. And the fertility one is, how much is it? Uh, it's 3,000. So we still are, are so we're still, we, we still need about a little less than 1,500 more to be able to do that. Um, okay, so we're going to try and see if we can... Okay, speed this up, Angelique. <laughs> oh my goodness. Imagine. Oh my god, then this toddler is gonna be so stressful. <gasps> oh yeah, and I also discovered that I can't age them up until they age up on their own. So that's like, what, a few days, I think? Or I don't think it's five, is it? I don't think it's five. So Marcus is here. Go ahead and get to know him. Um. Vampire. <gasps> Turn into vampire. Hold on, let's be romantic first. Embrace, because we don't want to come off too strong yet. So, oh my god, I'm so excited to turn, <sighs> turn him. What? Marcus, have you been seeing somebody behind our back or something? Why aren't you feeling us right now? I don't understand. What is going on? <gasps> you know what, Angelique? It's time to put on your alluring visage. So you'll be irresistible, okay? Yeah, exactly. I don't understand what's going on with you right now. There we go. Alright, maybe we should get to know him a little bit more. Okay, he's feeling flirty, so that's good, that's good. Um... Um, excuse me, why are you not into us right now? <laughs> Marcus, please. We need to have babies with you. <gasps> we can try for baby in a coffin. Okay, okay. Turn into vampire. Turn him in, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Give him the rose. Yes, queen. All right. Come on. Oh no, I can't, I can't, I can't control. I want to watch this. This is her turning her first sim. <gasps> oh, this is so exciting. Oh, 
All right. So the thing is, is I've, apparently it takes a few days. <gasps> what? That's so cool. Oh my god! What the heck? Oh, he's not feeling well. Marcus Fluke. Marcus Flukes. Marcus Lex has consumed the essence of a vampire and will turn in a few days' time. <gasps> yes. Okay. 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 So it looks like we won't be able to do much as of right now, but um, we're gonna have to. Looks like we're gonna have to start turning people sooner. So once he leaves, we're gonna go ahead and have to invite Gunther over as well and turn him into a vampire because if we don't, then, I mean, we, it takes a couple days for them to turn. So might as well have him ready for when we try for a baby with him. So, oh God, please tell me he can come over. It's only 10. All right, he's coming, he's coming. So hopefully we can turn him. Oh, he's already here. Gunther, hey, boo. All right, are you ready? Oh, no. Baby's crying. Don't, don't ruin the mood, Lilith. Okay, change her dirt diaper. All right. Okay, now invite Gunther. Gossip. Okay, we need to ask Marcus to leave because we don't want him to, uh... You know, oh, he has the bite on his neck. That is so awesome. Okay, 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 okay. Um, we're gonna ask Marcus to leave. We're gonna say thank you for coming, but um, you know, I think it's time for you to leave. Where the heck is? Tell him, ask him to leave. Um, okay, I don't know. But I guess we could just be nice to Gunther, and then uh, we can just go ahead and have her turn him. Hopefully that'll work. Turn into vampire. Oh. Oh no, this is really... No! Oh, Marcus, you weren't supposed to see that. No. Oh my god. This is what I'm saying. It's like I can't figure out how to make him leave. Alright. Turn him, girl. Turn him. Oh, I love this so much. Alright. Now she's gonna have him drink his blood. <laughs> Alright, so now we have two guys that are being turned into vampires. So this is awesome. Okay. Looks like we're able to try for a baby for a little bit though, so we're gonna have to wait until they have turned. I don't know when it'll tell me that they've turned. Um, does it tell you if they're a vampire? Okay, it'll tell me. I think. I'm assuming so. Because it tells me that he's a vampire, master vampire. And none of these people are vampires. So if, since they're just turning, maybe we need to find ourselves a vampire around here to try for a baby. Do we just try for a baby with uh, Vladis? Vlad? Can we do same sex babies or does it have to be just males? Cause I mean, there's some females around here. Um, I don't know. Okay, meet him. Let's see if he'll fall under our spell. Might as well just try for a baby with him. He's, he is an adult. He just looks like he's old. All right. You're not the ideal man, but I mean, ugh. I need to have a baby. <laughs> Talk about dreams. Just like get to know this guy. Let's see if we can start being flirty with him. I don't think our powers will work on him. Oh, okay. I think he's feeling us. Oh, there's Caleb. We have your babies. We're just gonna <laughs> try for baby with these right. They're like just hanging in our house while we're just trying to get to know him. Sexy pose. I need to find more vampires around here. I don't know. Like, there should be, like, a vampire club. Why did they think about doing that? I should really get going now. Thanks for hanging out with me. Bye, Marcus. Hopefully, you're gonna be a vampire the next time we see you. All right, first kiss. Will this be too far? I don't think so. Come on. Look at her. Oh, my God. I feel like the babies aren't gonna be that cute. I'm scared. Are they gonna have the first kiss? <gasps> they did! Okay, all right. They're feeling very flirty. This is good. Confess attraction. <gasps> no! Vlad! Oh, oh 
my gosh. Okay, get in here. Fly here's a bat. We're gonna go ahead and try and get Vlad to come back over because we need him. Oh wait, are they with each other? Where is she going? I'm coming for you, baby. <laughs> Where is she going? Where? I don't understand where she's going. Oh, he's over here. He escaped from us. What a guy. <gasps> Do these trees have fruit? Oh my god, we can harvest it. Oh my god, yes. Okay, hold on. Harvest this. Okay, you're really scary, actually. Okay, can you... Can you harvest the fruit, please, Angelique? Do that for me first, and then we can go ahead and woohoo with him at your house. Uh, we need to get Gunther to leave first, though. Alright, we're gonna have to go home anyway because our babies are here on their own <laughs> well gunther's technically kind of watching them so let's go ahead and fly here as a bat and ask gunther to leave ask to leave ask to leave and then let's see if we can woohoo oh no i don't need gunther i need to get vlad over here all right angelie can you need to call vlad send flirty text why did our meter go down already um, invite to current lot. Okay, so now our other men are out of the out of the building. Oh my god, our, why did our relationship go down so low with Marcus? Like we didn't really do anything that bad. Maybe he'll feel better once he's a vampire and he'll understand. <laughs> Where are you going? Are you going to sleep? Okay, she's taking a nap. We're gonna wait for Vlad to come here. No, he said he was already. Vlad is not here. Vlad, you liar. You are not even here. Okay, let's change the diaper. Let's feed our babies. Okay, we need thirst. Hold on, what do these plasma fruits do again? I can't remember. Oh, if I eat it, will it give me plasma? Will plasma fruit give me it? Oh, it does give me, oh my god, yes! Okay, breastfeed her. Okay, Vlad, you are literally not here, so I don't understand why you're saying you are when you're not. Okay, wait, let's go ahead and check out this tree over here and see if their plasma fruit is ready to harvest on this one is it oh it is okay come here fly here as a bat and then harvest this as well i was wondering we can we plant can we plant plasma trees because if we can then go ahead and harvest that and let me see if we can plant them can we plant this okay i don't think we can plant it plant Drag this item into the world and run the interaction. Oh, I can! All right, we're gonna plant this in the backyard. Get get here, fly here as a bat, and then we're gonna plant these in the backyard. So uh, get home. We're gonna plant them right here. We're gonna plant one, two, and three. Oh, she's stinky. Lilith is stinky. So go ahead and <laughs> change her diaper, and then we're gonna go over here and uh, plant these. Oh, I need to get rid of these notifications. We have to water them as well. And I don't think I can... I can't remember if I can hire professional gardeners. I'm not sure if I'm able to or not. So we're going to have to see after. Um, I'll check the loot. I'll check the rules later on and see if I can. But uh, I think I'm going to just have to try and stick with doing everything on my own. We're going to have our own... Oh no, she's burning up. I'm burning up, burning up for you, baby. Okay. You're almost done. And then you can run back inside. Fly here as a bat. And then we're going to go ahead and never go to sleep for a little bit. And drink some plasma fruit. Or have some plasma fruit. But she drinks it, doesn't she? Yeah, she sticks the straw. Okay, it, she's not. She's drinking something invisible. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why. That's glitched there. That looks so cool. She just sticks it in. Okay. Does that give her enough? Okay, it doesn't give you that much, but it's fine. It's good enough. All right, we're gonna go ahead and have her sleep. Oh my god, I love that so much. Okay, uh, I don't know why she woke up, actually. Can you sleep? Like, you need to get your energy up. I don't know why she woke up. Wow, look at that. Angelique got two simoleons for her book. I mean, that's, that's still money, so it counts. Okay, we're gonna go ahead downstairs because we need to take care of one of the babies. You guys, we're gonna need so much work done with you guys. What I'm gonna go ahead and do is try and see. Okay, I wonder if they've turned yet. Okay, I don't. Doesn't look like it. Uh, where is Marcus? Oh my God, Marcus is freaking. Why is our romance going down so low? No. Okay, we're gonna have to go ahead and invite Vlad over so we can try for a baby with him. We need to 
we need to search out for more vampires out in this world because I don't know who else is a vampire and it's really hard for us to walk around in the daytime. I need to figure out what I can do so she can walk in the daytime, but I don't know um, what perk that is. So I'm going to have to do some research on that and figure that out. But as for now, she's just going to have to stay out. Are you still sad? Okay, we're going to have to cuddle her. Donatella, it's okay. Mama's here. Vladis is a vampire and can't come over right now. Okay, since we can't hang out with Vlad right now, do we have any other vampire friends? Are any of these guys vampires? Yeah, it looks like I need to meet more vampires because I don't know any. Um, but we're going to go ahead and have her read the encyclopedia a little bit. Um, does she have it in her inventory? Yeah, she does. Okay, we're going to have her read and learn more about vampires. Congratulations on a new addition to the family. I mean, it is your baby, so, I mean, we could have you come over. Let's go ahead and invite Caleb over, and we can go ahead and, um, I don't know, we can have him train us, because training is important as well in her learning. So, we're gonna, after she reads a little bit and learns something, we're gonna go ahead and invite him over. Angelique read that there is special drink concoction which can allow vampires to walk in the daylight for a limited time. <gasps> well, we need to learn that. We're gonna have to buy a bar to learn that. Oh my god, you're already smelly, Lilith. I'm glad that she at least doesn't wake up her sister when she starts crying. Alright, there we go. So go ahead and invite Caleb. I'm gonna have her call Marcus and kind of like forgive him. I mean, apologize to him for, you know, being romantic with another man in front of him. Oh, there's Caleb. Oh, <gasps> vampire spar? I don't think, I don't think I've uh, been able to do that before. Please don't vampire, why are they talking through the door? Like, come in. All right, I wanna watch this. Oh, I love how you're inside, okay. Oh no, they're going outside. She's like gonna die while she's trying to spar. What are you wearing? Angelique, what is this outfit? What the heck, okay. All you see is like her burning. Oh, he won! Better luck next time, Angelique. <laughs> Aww. Okay, get in here, because this is not good. Fly here is a bat. She's burning up so much. Uncomfortable. Alright, change her diaper. Meet your daughters! Caleb, these are your daughters. What are you wearing? I don't understand where she even got this outfit from. I've never given this to her ever. <laughs> like, what is this? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and have her shower because she's a bit stinky. So let's go ahead and have her shower. Where's he going? He's going to sleep. Okay, I guess help yourself. Cause Caleb will do his thing. Oh, he's crying. Caleb, what's going on, man? What does this say? Productive duel from a good fight. Good sparring session. Even immortal vampires need to practice all the sweet moves if they plan, if the plan is being the one. Oh, look at her trees. <gasps> They're growing. Oh my god. Yes, Angelique. Look at you. We're going to have to plant more, actually. I think it's going to be a... Yeah, I think we should plant more. But... Yeah, let's go ahead and plant another one. But we're not going to have her planted until... Uh, later because we don't want her to come out here and burn oh my god she looks so cool i love her uh dark form outfit it's just so different like it's very like formal but i love it hey angelique we'd love to have you join the good timers what do you think i'm not really interested but thanks for the offer <gasps> wait can i just turn people into vampires hold up maybe i don't have to be romantic with them let me just see if i can start turning people into vampires and maybe we can uh, just have them ready for later. Oh my god, let me do that. Invite to hang out. Invite to hang out. Oh my god, I didn't even think about that. Because I don't have to be in a romantic relationship to turn them. I don't think I do, at least. Oh my god, look, we have like a party at our house. Hey. More vampire. Turn into vampire. Come on. Okay, bye, Caleb. Thanks for coming. All right, time to turn Raj. <gasps> All 
right. This is so cool. Okay. Okay, George is gonna be next. Basically, this episode is just me, me turning everybody into vampires. <laughs> Turn into vampire. I think that takes her energy away as well from turning Sims. So, I'm gonna have to be careful with that. All right, George. Your turn. He's just like, just casually walking in. <laughs> okay, Max is favoriting lots. Ooh, he wants to invite us over, but like we're kind of uh, have to take care of our kids. Okay, let me meditate quickly. <gasps> it's almost Antel's birthday. Wait, what? Don't they- I swear they're babies for like five- wait, is it three days? Wait, what? I'm so confused. How's it almost their birthday? I don't understand. Dark meditation- Angelique is benefiting from a previous dark meditation session. Oh, snap. She's probably have to take a nap. Alright, go- go fall- go- go take a nap because, um, we don't want you to run out of energy and pass out while trying to turn all these sims into vampires. So we've turned George and Raj. Oh no! Can somebody take care of my baby while I go take a nap? What's your name? Joaquin. Aww. <laughs> He's like, I don't know what to do. Guys, can you just pick them up? Okay, I know they're cute, but can you just like help me out here? I'm a single mom. Okay. Looks like I'm just gonna have to come down here and take care of it myself. I'm scared to turn anybody else because I'm afraid that she's gonna run out of energy and I don't want her to like die or anything. I don't know if they can, but I'm just worried about that. So I'm gonna hold off on turning everybody else. <gasps> Vladis is calling. Hey Angelique, it's me, Vladis. Do you want to go out on a date? You know, that's cute and all, but, like, I'm kind of busy right now. So, I'm probably, you know, we can just invite him over. Let's go ahead and invite Vladis over. Invite to current lot. And then we can maybe try and woohoo with him. Yes! Oh, he's coming over. All right. Awesome. So, hopefully, she'll be pregnant at the end of this episode. Okay, so it looks like our relationship went down a little bit, which is unfortunate. But we're going to have to try and bring it up. Um, and good thing we don't have any romantic relationship with these guys, so nobody can get jealous, which is good. All right. What? He was holding invisible baby. Okay. My child goes invisible. Go change your diaper, Angelique. Come on. Oh, the effects are going in, I think. Oh, are you joking right now, Vladis? Like, we literally... Okay, let's try this slow again. Why aren't you into us, Vlad? What is wrong with him? Oh my god, I think he's a bad vampire, but it's okay. I just need your babies. <gasps> it worked. Okay. You have to just go slow and see if this will work. <gasps> it says woohoo and coffin, so maybe we'll be able to. Oh, okay, he's taking our rose. Who's at our door? Who is this? Is this a vampire? Just some random knocking on our door. Okay. <gasps> yes, they're kissing. Okay, good, good, good. Romance. Embrace. <gasps> can they woohoo yet? <gasps> Whisper seductively. All right, this is good. This is good. Yes, yes, they can. Romance and try for baby. Let's see if she's going to be pregnant. <gasps> Oh, he's excited. Okay, let's go, guys. All right. <laughs> Come on in. <laughs> yes! I love, like, the animations. Oh, my God. Okay. We're going to see a lot of this. <laughs> okay. 
All right, let's go pregnancy test and let's see if she's gonna have a baby or not. Vlad, 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 you better give us some twins or even triplets at this point. Oh my god, no, maybe not because I'm stressing out already with two. Is she pregnant? Okay, okay, awesome. This is so good. Okay, cool. I'm excited. I'm really excited. We're gonna go ahead and feed her as well. <laughs> he found out that she's pregnant and he's like, uh, I think I'm just gonna go. <laughs> Donatella just became good friends with Angelique. Aw, so cute. Okay, we're gonna have to do the same thing with Lilith because we want to have good relationships with our children. Oh, <laughs> you're such a cute mom, Angelique. Oh, they became good friends too. Oh my god, that's awesome. Okay, we're gonna have her get her energy up and everything and uh, I think I'm actually gonna go ahead and end this episode here because I don't want to make it way too long and uh, Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and have her sleep and eat and then I'll be back with you guys with another episode All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll talk to you guys in another video. Bye guys <laughs>